Peace and blessings to everybody today. I got a question for y'all. Are you looking to improve or are you looking to prove yourself? What are you looking to improve on? Is it characteristics? Is it your ambition, your devotion, your dreams, anything? Are you looking to be a better person or are you looking to continue to try to be an evil person? What are you looking to improve on? Because you can improve on evil things also. What are you? What is your mindset at right now? I ask these things because we have to get our heart in check and we have to get our mind, body, and soul in check with God. And I also ask, are you trying to prove yourself? Because one thing that we got to understand that is a difference between improving yourself and proving yourself. If you're trying to improve yourself, it could be for the next person. It could be something that you're fighting against. But we also have to understand that if we're trying to prove ourselves that we are in a wrong mindset. You know why? We got to understand that we cannot run away from ourselves. We can't run away from sin. We can't run away from temptation. We only can resist and get stronger. So we always should be in the mindset of trying to improve ourselves, but not for us, for God. Because if we focus on God, God's automatically going to build us until we want we want to be. He says, follow him, truly seek his face, and all things that you will, that you desire will come as long as they're in his will. Understand that if it's in his will, it's good for you because... He's not a selfish God. God is a loving God, a caring God. He wants the best for us, but we got to understand that we got to go through these trials and tribulations. We actually have to believe. We got to stay true to ourselves, stay true to God. Uh, don't do like dirty things behind closed doors because God will expose everything. He always says, whatever is in the dark may come to light. We're not here to prove ourselves to anybody. We don't even know most people in your life. Most people you're going to walk past and you're not going to even ever see them again. Most people are not going to even care for you, but you got to learn to care for others still like Jesus did. Jesus understand the human life and he understood everything that comes with it. He understand all the demonic things that comes with it also. So when it comes to that, you got to think how strong Jesus actually was to fulfill his prophecy. Now it's time for us to fulfill our prophecy and discover what it is, though. We have to seek God's face to see what is our purpose in life. What do you have for me? Why was I born today? And that's pretty much it, man. Look to improve yourself, not prove yourself. Peace and blessings.